Hey Hallie Cats and welcome back to another video. This one is fun. I'm so excited. I know that this was kind of a waited. I got in a couple comments about um, needing a apartment tour. Um, I won't be showing the bedrooms in this tour just because my bedroom, I have a different video plan for it because it's not done yet. So I'm not revealing my room until it's done. Um, but we have our Halloween decorations up as well. So I thought it'd be really fun to do like a Halloween version of an apartment tour. I think it'd be so fun because we just happened to move in right before Halloween and I got all the decorations up and I think that it's gonna be really fun. And I'm also gonna show one DIY in this video as well of some stuff that I made and because I'm adding to the decorations in this. It'll be the last couple things that I do. So yeah, I think it'd be really fun to show you guys the apartment, uh, but spooky version. So yeah, uh, we're gonna do a little tour and we're gonna show a little DIY and we're gonna have a little montage of how all of it looks at night because right now it's obviously the daytime. And yeah, so I guess let's get into it. Hey, Hallie Cat, so I'm editing this video right now. I don't look the best right now because it's an editing day and I don't normally try and get ready on editing days. But I forgot to say this in the intro. I don't support JK Rowling and I don't support that she said some very transphobic things over the summer. Most of these I purposely DIY'd so that way I didn't have to give money to her as much. And I please um, like go on Etsy, support small businesses, small artists, queer artists, um, you know, LGBTQ youth as far as that goes and get stuff from them versus shopping from Harry Potter merchandise if you can for the most part. Um, also, this is a like kind of fundraiser video and I will have a link below to a GoFundMe for the Trevor Project. So if you could just donate to the link in the bio below um, and it'll all, all the proceeds go to the Trevor Project. So if you could just please donate and um, yeah, let's just, I just wanted to make that very clear that this is like a fundraiser type video and I don't support JK Rowling. Harry Potter was my childhood and I've been obsessed with Harry Potter since I was in fourth grade, but I don't endorse people who are transphobic, homophobic, anything like that. And yeah, so um, enjoy this video and don't forget to donate and yeah, thank you. <laughs> All right, so just so you know, um, right outside my door, I have a pool, which is really dope. I have my Hogwarts sign right here. I actually took a sign from Five and Below, scraped it all off, painted it, and wrote my own letters on it. I used a dry erase board marker and put Chamber of Secrets has been open, enemies of the air beware. And then this is from something from Dollar Tree. And then I printed that out so that and put it on there. So that is the entrance. All right, so we have an overview, which is really cool. All right, so over here we have our shoe rack, obviously. Broom parking, of course, and our spiders that trail down, uh, reference to the second one, Chamber of Secrets. We have the letters. We have some floating candles, which is really cool. We have Brendan's bar cart here. He is 21, just disclaimer. Um, spider webs up here. We have this little area, and this is these are some examples of some things that I might be showing because I painted all of those. I DIY'd them myself, so I'm going to show you guys how you can do something very similar to that. And then I have this little cauldron from Party City. This is from Target, the Madam Magicas and Chantamans and Spells. I got this off Amazon, which is really cool. The floating candles were also from Amazon. Over here, I had this leftover actually from, I got it at Spirit Halloween, I think, two years ago. And these spell books, they came from Spirit Halloween as well. That was on Amazon. Um, if you want, I can link some of the stuff down below if you would like. The envelopes, I actually made those myself. So I just bought envelopes and colored on them. Uh, really easy thing to do. The tapestry was at Spirit Halloween. We have some decorations here. So this crystal ball was actually something that I bought off I below and I painted the bottom of it. So that was really cool. And then I printed out a bunch of pictures and burnt the sides of the paper. Yes, that's a cardboard cutout of Matthew McConaughey. Um, <laughs> but I printed out and burned some pictures to look kind of like floating frames around the wall. Um, if only they can move. And then I have the four 
um, founders of Hogwarts right here, as well as some wanted posters of Sirius and Bellatrix up here. I thought it'd be fun. So yeah, that is the whole living room. It's actually pretty big and we have like it all furnished now and it looks really cute. Um, all right, so moving on to the kitchen, we wanna eventually get bar stools right here just um, to eat. I think it'd be great since we don't really have the room for a dining room. But we have our kitchen. Sorry if it's a little messy right now. I'm about to meal prep. You guys will get more meal prep vlogs, I promise. But this kitchen is so nice. I love it so much. It came with all these appliances already. So here's that. Um, these are some of the bottles that I'll be showing you guys that I'm painting and DIYing. I have so many of them and I can put them around the entire apartment, which is great. We have a back patio area. This is our little pantry. So yeah, we have the, the full kitchen my spice rack. Uh, we have stuff in the cabinets everywhere. The next thing we want to try and do, I think, or I want to try and do is organize some of the drawers and stuff because also like this drawer is a little bit disorganized. So watch, and it has the safe same slam features. Like can we, yes, yes. Um, that's not closed all the way. Oh, whoops. So yeah, this is our full kitchen. I think it's so cute. We have our patio area. So these are my plants over back here. Again, uh, my roommate is 21, disclaimer. We have my compost bin over here, um, my little hello mat, but we have it on the back door just because it fits the vibe out here a little bit more. Uh, eventually, I wanna get one for the front door eventually. That's our cute little patio area. Doo -doo -doo. So then we're gonna go all the way over here. We have this hallway entry area, a bunch of storage here. There we go. All right, so we have a bunch of storage right here. Down there we have like um, Christmas and Halloween decorations up here. We have some like towels and stuff. We have Brendan's room. We're not gonna look inside of there because that's his room. We have the bathroom. Hello. So yeah, we have all my stuff right here. Ugh, look at that skincare routine though. And my Caro vitamins, yes. Tanner side, we have the whole little look here. And I love this shower so much. It's so pretty, and the shower head, ugh, oh, yes, to die for. And then I have some hooks on the back for my robe. Uh, so that's our cute little bathroom. I think it's so cute, I enjoy it a lot. And then over here we have Tanner's room, um, and my room, and then this is where like the water heater is. So yeah, um, that is our entire apartment. Uh, I think it's really cute, and I love the decorations that I've put up. I wish I had thought of this video sooner and I would have filmed more of the shopping that I did for it and me like hanging up most of it. I just thought about it way too late in the game, <laughs> I feel like. But I'm gonna make it up with for you guys with this one DIY, hopefully. And you guys now know what my apartment looks like, so yeah. Okay, so I have all of my painting supplies down here. You can't really see it, but I'm gonna be painting up like this, hopefully, so you guys can see it more. Um, but yeah, let me show you the setup real quick. So I have all the bottles right here on some paper towels, as well as all the paint and brushes over there. And I have my camera sitting on that. <laughs> so yeah. Alrighty, so here's what they look like so far. I'm gonna let them dry and then I'm gonna do some hot glue stuff and yeah. Okay, so update, the paint is all dry. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hot glue gun some lines on most of them. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna film while I'm doing that. My face is not gonna be in the picture, but yeah, we're gonna time lapse that.
Okay, so I finished with the um, hot glue part. So I'm just gonna go paint over the colors again and then they'll be done and I'll show you guys the finished product. And that's the end of the DIY. I've decided to keep those ones plain because they look like potion bottle enough, but I was trying to disguise that these ones were more like weird. Okay, so this is the final product of them. I put these ones on this little table over here and they are so cute. I really like them a lot. Uh, so yeah, that's what they look like all painted. And then I put the little black bottle ones over here. I think they're so cute and they complete the look a little bit more. So yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Comment down below what else you would like to see during the spooky season. Um, I have a vlog that I already have done ready to go. It's a costume reveal vlog. But if there's anything other specific that you'd like to see me do, let me know because I'm trying to get some content out for you guys for Halloween. And yeah, I guess until next time. Say bye. Bye, Hallie cats. <laughs> She's like, what? <laughs>